Hi, I'm Paula from MeMakeyThings.com and today I'm going to share with you how to restring a beaded necklace. So what I have right here is actually not a necklace, it is half of a watch band, but it's the same concept and a necklace would just be a longer piece. So say you've broken it uh, at one end and either all the beads or some of the beads have slid off. What you would want to do first of all is um, lay it out in the pattern that the beads were strung in so that you know what order to put your beads in. And um, I still have some of them on my, on my uh, wire here so I know what the pattern is. But here are my loose beads. So uh, this had a lobster claw on both ends of it and then it just attached onto the watch like that. But you may have one type of a lo lobster claw and maybe a loop or something at the other end, but attaching it will be the same uh, method for, on both ends. So what you're gonna need is to go to the store and get some uh, beading wire. This is Beadalon. You might wanna take your beads with you so that you um, make sure that you get the right diameter so that you don't have uh, some wire that won't fit through your beads. So cut yourself a piece longer than what you need. And one thing you might want to do is uh, maybe uh, fold this over and put a piece of tape or something on the end of it so that your beads don't slide off on the end. But I'm just going to slip a couple beads on here and show you how to do the attachment. So you would Try to get these on in the same design, or you could make a new design if you wanted to. And then what you need is a crimp bead. And if you don't know what this is, you need to ask for it by name um, at your craft store or jewelry supply place. And what it is is a little soft bead that will um, that you can pinch down to hold your beads in place. So you want to take your beading wire and slide it through. A lot of them look like kind of a little tube. And then slide that through the, your clasp. And then move it back around and loop it through the other end. You know, if you can see that I have like a little loop there. Slide your bead, oops, just slid it out. Okay, there we go. Okay, so now I have a little loop there. Slide the bead, slide the uh, crimp bead all the way down to the end. And then you can take a pair of needle nose pliers and just pinch that till it's tight. Then, as your beads come down, you can slide the first few beads over the, the excess wire. If you, have, if you uh, get too thick a wire again, this will be hard to do. Then you have a little bit of extra hanging out there and you can just clip the extra off there. And then the other thing you might want to do is uh, right by the crimp bead is use a little bit of super glue and uh, put a little dab on there and that will help hold your necklace together. Then you just string the rest of your beads on in your pattern and fasten the clasp on the other end in the same way. And that is how you restring a beaded necklace. I'm Paula from MeMakeyThings.com. Have a great day.